Hello guys, this is uh, the Blade 330S. I got it upgraded on an X Nova XTS. X Nova XTS. Uh, this model is a 3S and a 4 cell model at the same time. I have uh, the AVN 45 amp ESC in here. And I did take out the the telemetry receiver that it came with this helicopter, the H6250HS or something like that receiver, fly baller unit. I changed it for the AR7210BX. Reason, cause I'm gonna put this in my uh, uh, scale uh, heli 450 heli body with retract. So, and this flight is gonna be on 3S. The first flight wasn't what well, the motor was too tight the mesh was too tight on the main gear so i kind of loosened it up a little bit so to test your motor mesh you will have to put a paper in between if it rips the paper it's too tight if it doesn't you're pretty much golden so stay tuned i'm about to fly this right now All right, guys. My uh, my my uh, iPhone 11 battery is low, so if it dies, that means it wasn't me. But my battery is about to die. So it's yeah, a quick flight. All right, guys, there we go. Ready for it, 30 S. I did take flight. Sorry guys, my phone dropped. So let's try it one more time. Nova, this is the X Nova XTS. I'm not trying to uh, put too much power on it because I still gotta break down the break in the motor.
not trying to give you too much power, like too much like a punch out. I still got to break in the motor. It's brand new. That's Nova XPS. I will consider this for anybody who want to fly the blade. Uh, want to do an upgrade on their blade 330S. It's a good motor and you get a lot of power for your 330S helicopter. This motor is not cheap. It figures like $85, $92 with a uh, factory. Uh, this is the Nova XPS. All right, guys. This is model aircraft, the 330S with a area 7210BX and an X Nova XTS. And uh, I like this model so far. It's uh, it looks like it's powerful. I don't have to do too much on the collective to let this thing kick up. So. After I break in, I really will see what this motor is made out of. Signing out.